So very interesting question a student has. She says, hey, Mike, your PDFs are a lifesaver. Thanks a lot. But I have a doubt. The genetics questions you've written, are they NBME spoilers? Okay, this is a concern students will have sometimes that my high yield PDFs, which I've discussed, I derive my information from the NBME exams, okay, and my nine plus years of tutoring. I don't include, when, when I write my high yield PDFs, I don't just arbitrarily write information that's in that's from obscure resources. I mean, it, the NBMEs are the USMLE. So the content that's important for you to know is ultimately derived from the NBME exams. And what the fuck do you think the QBanks do? Okay, they do the same thing. Info is derived from NBME exams. So this student has the concern regarding my genetics PDF uh, because the high yield genetics PDF is a 50 question PDF, okay? Very, very fucking effective for learning genetics. Your genetics will go from literally an F to an A by going through my high yield genetics PDF, which I'll link in the description below. But this student has the concern about, will this spoil her NBME scores? And the answer is no. Firstly, I have written those questions. They are unique questions. They are not duplicates of NBME questions, okay? That's obviously copyright infringement. They are unique questions that I have developed, and the explanations are unique, okay? But regardless, student might say, even if they're unique questions you've written, because you are ultimately deriving your info from the NBMEs, aren't they still spoiling my score? And the answer is no, that if you are studying the right material, your scores will go up on the NBMEs. There's no such thing as an inflation on the NBME exams. If you are studying obscure resources that have no fucking relation to the NBME and USMLE content, no, your scores will not go up. If you are studying valuable information, the correct info, then your scores will go up on the NBME exams. It's not fucking magic, okay? So, but it, it's it's a reasonable concern that students will have because you obviously want to have the most pragmatic uh, expectations possible. You want to be able to accurately gauge your progress. So it's an it, I can empathize with that sentiment that you don't want to spoil or inflate your scores, okay? But in turn, I will repeatedly have to inculcate the point that no, my high yield PDFs are not spoiling or inflating your scores. Your scores will go up only because the info that I have in my PDFs is the best fucking information out there. It saves you time. It's not superfluous. It's well consolidated. Do you know the deal? I'm going to continue to make more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.